Hello, I am Ram Gopal from presentationprocess.com. In this edition of PowerPoint Diagrams tutorial series, you will learn how to create simple funnel diagram in PowerPoint. The funnel diagram you will learn to create looks like this. Isn't this beautiful? If you were to compare this funnel diagram with the standard smart art graphic that you get from smart art option which you see here insert smart art relationship and funnel here if you were to compare this smart art graphic with this diagram created using auto shapes you can see that this diagram looks far more professional than this one and it is surprisingly easy to create this funnel graphic and let me show you how to do it from scratch let us go to a new slide the first step in creating the funnel graphic is to go to auto shapes under basic shapes pick up this tool called as isosceles triangle now draw an isosceles triangle the next step is to invert it so let me go to arrange rotate and flip vertical now we have the isosceles triangle flipped vertically the next step is to go to auto shapes once again and go to rectangles and draw the stem of the funnel and this much looks good enough now just to be sure that the stem and the body of the funnel are aligned properly go to arrange align align center now there we can be sure that these two shapes are aligned perfectly the next step is to make it look three dimensional for which let me go to basic shapes once again and I'm going to pick this tool called as oval tool and draw an ellipse which touches both the corners here so and if you want to make sure that you make minor adjustments you can always press control and press the up button so that you can move um, the shape pixel by pixel now we have got the top one done now let us go once again to basic shapes and pick the oval tool and let us draw the ellipse here too now that looks good now while holding the control move the shape to the bottom and make sure that the ellipse is placed right in the middle so let me show you what I mean by this let's go to no fill and if you see here that the ellipse is placed halfway into the stem of the funnel and halfway outside and that's very important all right now the next step is to shade these various shapes so that you get a three-dimensional view now I'm going to select this one and first let me remove the shape outline from all of these so let me go and shape outline is no outline now this one I'm going to shape uh, select first and let me give it a dark blue color and to give it a three-dimensional shade go to shape fill again go to gradient and the gradient you're going to use is this one called as linear right as you can see here it is darker here and is progressively lighter as it goes to the right now this makes it look like the light is falling from here and it is the darkest on this side now you can apply the same gradient to this one as well so I'm going to click on it and I'm going to use format painter tool so that I can use the same formatting here too and it is done the next thing is to click on this one and once again use the same blue color and this time I'm not really going to bother too much with giving it the gradient fill so the first level is done the next thing is I'm going to select this top ellipse and I'm going to use a light blue color so that it feels like the light is falling from the top and to make sure that there is a shadow going down I'm going to go to shape fill again gradient and I'm going to use this option called as linear down 
and there it is there is nothing more to it your funnel is done if you want to resize it select everything press control g to group it and you can pull the corners inwards so that the shape the uh, the funnel graphic gets reduced proportionally and you can always represent the input and output by way of arrows i am going to choose uh, the downward arrow which you can see here under block arrows and i'm going to draw an arrow here remove outline and to distinguish it from the color of the funnel i'm going to use say this red and i'm going to keep it here and while holding the control tab i'm going to make multiple copies yeah so it shows multiple inputs now i am going to pick one and put it here and this represents output and once it is done once again i can group it maybe resize it a little more if needed and i can always represent this as your text about the input maybe make it to 20 and reduce it a little bit and i've got it here this again shape outline is no outline and maybe i can use this red color or maybe this color i mean you can you can decide how exactly you want to show this call out and you can do the call out for the inputs you can do the call out for the body and for the output and if you have done what i have talked about this is how your final diagram would look like so that is how you create funnel diagram in powerpoint using auto shapes let me show you some example templates which also show you variations in funnel diagram and these example templates are taken from our powerpoint ceo packs volume 1 and 2 this is a stage wise funnel diagram as you can see here the second stage the third stage and the stem and here we talk about the inputs and here you have the option to write the text which explains this funnel diagram let me show you another example here you can see the sheen on the funnel and each stage comes on click now let me show you another diagram and here we have played with the gradient fill option to give you multiple stage wise diagrams and as you can see here this is an ellipse and here i have added an ellipse and given the same color as this one so you are not able to see this ellipse and that is how i have created this whole funnel diagram and here again we are going to talk about the various stages if you are a busy business presenter who doesn't have the time to create such professional looking graphics for yourself you can always take a look at off the shelf solutions like our powerpoint ceo packs volume 1 and 2 The two CEO packs have more than 1600 fully editable charts and graphics for CEOs and business presenters. Just choose the template that matches your thought and replace the sample text with your own text. Your business slides get ready in no time. Creating professional looking business slides has never been easier. Hope you liked our tutorial on creating funnel diagram in PowerPoint. If you want to learn more such tutorials please visit us at presentationprocess.com There are tons of useful articles videos and tutorials to help you improve your presentation skills and powerpoint skills Thanks a lot for watching the video and happy presenting